underwater video of Bethany Bass on its bed. Well, we went back to uh, Bethany. It was very windy. Uh, wanted to try getting some underwater video and see if we can get some shots of uh, bass on their bed. So we found this one lurking in the shallows and uh, was able to get uh, some shots of it moving in and out of its bed. And it's tough to see. It's really murky behind it, but uh, about three, four other beds behind this one. And uh, as we kept uh, taking the video, it, we sped it up because uh, it kept coming in and out of the uh, frame. You can see this one's pretty much protecting its area. And you don't really see it, but there's a we're using a uh, fishing fly that we're trying to drag across its bed, and we doesn't really get through the picture very much, but we do get through there, and uh, you may see a glimpse of it. Cool stuff. Uh, after about 15, 20 minutes, started getting used to the camera and even started checking out the, uh, the flashing light on it. So we started out with a purple damselfly and then we switched over to a brown damselfly or olive and then we went to a white guadalupana and uh, it finally got it to hit on the guadalupana. There's the hit. Cool stuff. One a very big one. Still good to get this uh, underwater shot of it. Here we slowed it down. There's the take. He actually spits it out. And then chases it. goes for it again. And uh, at that point it's hooked. Normally we can see the, the strike with our polarized lenses, uh, but today it was very windy so the service was very choppy so we couldn't really see so we're pretty much blind casting. So uh, we could see the take or we could at least see a strike happening or it chasing it, but uh, couldn't actually see that moment where we where we set the hook normally. So still good uh, being able to catch them. So here it is. Not a bruiser. It's still uh, fun to catch. And even better that we got the strike on uh, video. So we're going to go and let it go now. Let's see if we can get it big. Get uh, Let it get bigger. And there it goes. Until next time, good luck and good fishing.